back to my channel for another video. I am so excited you guys decided to join me here today. Today I'm sharing with you what I got my kids for Christmas. If you're new here, I am Cassidy. I have two kids. My son Brayden is two, my daughter Brooklyn is five. So I'm gonna be sharing with you all of the things that I got my kids for Christmas this year. There is a lot of things. I also wanted to share with you some money saving tips this holiday season, just in case you guys are on a tighter budget. Everybody's on a tight budget I feel like these days and why not try to make it a little bit less stressful and a little bit easier for us during the holidays so you can enjoy more time with your family and your friends and not stress about getting everybody gifts. So I'm gonna start off with the money saving tips just because there's, I mean, there's not that many of them, but I figured I would might as well share them with you. You're gonna see a lot of presents here for my kids, but I did not spend a lot of money on any of these things. A lot of these things I either bought secondhand from either Facebook Marketplace or the Mercari app. And then everything that you see that is new here, I got at Walmart and Target when they had their massive toy clearance in the summertime. So I paid dirt cheap prices. Some of these items were 90% off. So I did not spend a ton of money. It looks like a lot of stuff. It is a lot of stuff but I did not spend an arm and a leg for it, which is great. I've also been able to give back a lot this holiday season with all of these extra toys that I bought because I did buy quite a bit of toys during the summertime. So that way I would be able to donate things to people who are in need in my local area and all of that. So, and also if you guys don't buy things ahead of time, buy things throughout the year. When you see them, put them away, throw them in your shed, throw them in your garage, throw them in your attic, wherever you have space to throw them, throw them in there and save them because I literally have not spent any money since August on my kids for Christmas and they've been done since then. So it relieves all the stress of the holidays for me and all of that and I really, really, really suggest doing that if you don't do that already. Okay, enough talking. I definitely talk way too much. But I'm gonna jump in. I'm gonna start with my daughter first. She's five. I'm gonna show you all the things that I got for her. And now also I wanted to say these are not items from Santa Claus. Santa Claus comes separately. like. These are just items that mommy and daddy buy for them for Christmas because we like to spoil our kids a little bit. So yeah, my daughter's super into Frozen. So we got this Frozen Anna doll. She's gonna love this. She loves baby dolls. She loves to play with dolls. She loves Frozen, perfect. She's also really into Barbies. So I found this really cute Barbie from Walmart. It's like a Barbie lifeguard. I thought it was super cute. Comes with a little golden retriever puppy. She's gonna love this. She loves all kinds of Barbie sets and everything like that. Now, if you know my daughter, you know she's the biggest girly girl on the planet. So lately she's been really into bringing her purse with her everywhere we go. So I found these cute little DIY messenger bags for her. I think they're gonna be so fun. Of course they have flip sequins, anything sparkly she loves, but she can color them herself and kind of design them how she wants them to be designed. And then she could bring them on our shopping trips. And I think she's gonna love these. These are from Walmart. Super inexpensive, I think they're like $2 a piece when I bought them. She's also obsessed with makeup, and when I say obsessed, like, you have no idea. She loves makeup, so I found these, it's also from the same brand as the Messenger Bags, it's the Be Inspired brand by Crazy Art, and these are these little lava lamp lip glosses. I think she's gonna absolutely love these. I mean, I would've loved these when I was a five-year-old little girl. I wasn't really allowed to wear makeup when I was that young, but. We let her be creative, we let her do her own thing. So she's got more makeup than probably CVS does. But she is going to love these. They're so cute, like little lava lamp lip glosses. I feel like it's such a creative idea that I just, I thought she would love it. Also, while we're talking about makeup, we got this little Barbie carry case with real makeup in it. It's got like this little unicorn and all of these little makeup sets. It's like a little makeup set for her. So she's gonna love this. I also have another one of these messenger bags. This one does not have the flip sequence with it, but it is a little cute unicorn messenger bag that she can DIY herself. I figured these are gonna be great little projects for her to do on a rainy day or when it's too cold to go outside and play. So this will be perfect for her during the winter time. She can design all her little bags and she'll have multiple bags to go with all of her different outfits because that's how she likes to roll. I also found this really fun Hollywood hair extension maker. I think she's gonna love this. In the summertime when we dyed her hair pink, purple, and blue, like little streaks, like highlights in it, she absolutely loved it. But when school time happens, she can't really go to school like that. So I thought this would be a really fun activity for her to do so she can create these little clips that go in her hair. She can style them how she wants and all of that. I think this will be a really fun activity for her as well. 
We have this other little Barbie playset. It's a little Chelsea doll with her little doggy, and I just thought it was so cute. She loves Barbies. Chelsea's one of her favorites to play with, so any Barbie set that comes with Chelsea, she's all about. So I thought this one was super cute. I thought she would have fun with it. I like Barbie because she can use her imagination when she's playing and all of that. Another Barbie Chelsea set is this Barbie Dreamtopia treehouse set. This is absolutely adorable. This little Chelsea has fairy wings, which my daughter's going to love. She does not have a Chelsea that has fairy wings yet, so she's going to love this. It comes with a little treehouse and a little swing set and a little puppy with fairy wings as well. So she's going to love this. This was $5 at Walmart in the summertime, guys. $5. Like, this thing I think normally retails for like $25 and I got it for five. So you can't beat these prices. I also found this little Hello Kitty little fold up carry case play set. This reminds me of Polly Pockets. I played with Polly Pockets when I was younger. She actually has a few Polly Pockets sets that she loves to play with. And I just thought this was a really cute version of that. It's just Hello Kitty characters. And I thought she would have a lot of fun playing with this. It's like a little tea party set so they can have their own little tea party together. I also found this really fun Frozen 2 toy. This is the little glow, walk and glow fire spirit toy from Frozen. If you press a little button, it like walks around the house like a little pet. This is probably going to freak my dog out, but she's going to love this. She can play with it. And I think her brother's going to love this as well. He's two and I think he's going to think this is like the coolest thing ever. So they're going to have a lot of fun playing with this together. And I just thought it was cute how it lights up and walks around the house. So fun. So she's going to have a lot of fun with that. They both pull together. She's also obsessed with unicorns. So I found this little unicorn pet. It, it's like a little walking unicorn. It has a little leash for it. So you can walk it around and take it for walks outside and stuff. So I thought she would have a lot of fun with this. She saw something like this at the store before. And of course she was begging for it. So I picked this up when it was on Walmart clearance. I think it was like $3.50 or something like that. Ridiculous prices, like I said. But she's going to have a lot of fun with this. Another really fun item, which I think will be fun for the whole family, is this Trolls karaoke machine. We love to have dance parties in our house. We love to sing. We cannot, none of us can sing, but we love to try. But I thought this would be a, so much fun for us to do with the kids, have a little dance party singing competition. And I thought they would have so much fun with it. So I picked this up at Walmart when it was on clearance in the summertime. They had some like smaller versions, but this was like the bigger, more advanced version or whatever. So I thought it was gonna be so much fun for the whole family. We love to do like family game nights and like just little activities together. And I thought this would just be such a fun thing for all of us to do together. And what little five-year-old and two-year-old don't love things with a microphone so they can hear them their voice echo? They're gonna love this. I might regret this one later on. I'll let you guys know. But as long as they're having fun, whatever. This is another toy that I think her and her brother will both love. This is this Frankie the Funky Flamingo. Try to say that five times fast. It's probably going to be impossible. Not even going to try because I will embarrass myself. But this thing is so fun. It twirls its neck. It dances to funky songs, it says. And I think my kids will love it. They love anything that has push buttons and talks. So let's see what he does. So fun. So cute. They're going to have a lot of fun with this. Okay, this next item is this just little Love Diana mini set. She watches this girl on YouTube, I believe. So I just thought it would be a fun little thing. She loves little dolls and little things. She could play with this with her Barbies and stuff. It's small enough for her to do whatever she wants with it, but I thought she would have fun with it. It comes with a little hairbrush so she could brush her hair and style it up and all of that. So I think she'll really enjoy this doll. Her baby brother is so into dinosaurs. He has so many dinosaurs and I never see dinosaurs that are like geared towards girls. So I, when I found this, I knew I had to have it. It is this Tyrannosaurus from the Cave Club. It's perfect for a little girl. It's a cute little dinosaur for the girls. She has a couple of these Cave Club Barbie dolls that go with it. So it can be like their pet and she will have her own dinosaur to play with with her brother. So she's like the biggest girly girl. So she doesn't want like just the stereotypical dinosaurs. She wants the pretty color ones. So what did we get her? A really pretty color dinosaur. So she's going to love playing with this with her brother and her brother's going to love it too because she'll, she'll play with him and they'll have fun together. It will be perfect. And that's a win for mom when they can actually play nicely together. I'm sure your moms feel me on that. 
Another dinosaur item that I got for her is this cute little dinosaur baby alive baby doll. I just, when I saw this, I had to get it. Her brother's probably going to fight her on this one because he likes baby dolls to play with as well. So I don't know. I might give this to him. I might give this to her. I'm not sure, but I thought it was really fun. I thought it came with this cute little dinosaur cup for the baby. It comes with like some diapers and baby alive baby dolls. She's been wanting forever, so I just thought it would be pretty fun for her to be able to play with this with her brother. Hopefully they don't fight over it. We'll see. Another item that I got for both her and her little brother is this bubble gun. This thing I saw on Facebook, and it was like one of their Facebook ads. So I don't know how good it is. I don't know anything about it really. It was cheap, but my kids both love playing with bubbles. So I got this. It's supposed to like blow it's like a fan little fan gun thing that blows a billion bubbles everywhere so i think they will both have so much fun with these if they actually work out so we'll see not sure how good it is like i said but hopefully it'll be fun for them to play with together they each got one of these hers is pink his is blue another really fun item that i got for her is this easy bake oven i had one of these when i was her age and i loved it so much I feel like my love for baking started when I was really young and she loves to bake. She bakes with me. She's my little baking helper all the time. So I thought this would be so much fun for us to do together. She can make her own little pastries and cakes and they even have like pizzas and stuff that you can make now with these things. They have upgraded them since I was little, which was a long time ago, but I thought this would be something so much fun for her and I feel like it will just help her learn how to cook. And I think she's going to have so much fun with this and I might have fun too. So it'll be something we can play with together. And then to go along with the Easy Bake Oven, I got these two little Easy Bake Oven sets. This one is like a red velvet strawberry cake set, and this one is a pizza set. So these will be like our first little tests for the Easy Bake Oven. I remember when I was younger, I made my grandfather a birthday cake with it. It wasn't cooked. He ate it anyway because he was trying to be nice, but we'll see. Hopefully the Easy Bake Oven has upgraded and it actually works now and actually cooks the food but we're gonna test it out with these two amazing options. And I think she's gonna have a lot of fun making them. We're almost done with all my daughter's things. Next up is this Jojo Siwa doll. My daughter loves Jojo. Her fourth birthday was a Jojo Siwa birthday, so she loves Jojo. And she also loves these like My Life dolls or like My Generation or these are the My Life ones, but she loves them. So when I saw this Jojo Siwa one from Walmart, of course, I had to pick it up. This was an online purchase in the summertime. They were marked down to $10. So, steal of a deal for one of these dolls. These things are normally expensive. And I think she's going to have so much fun. She has two other ones. She has two other R Generation dolls, the ones that Target sells. And she loves them so much. And I think she's going to love this. So, this is going to be one of her favorite things, I think, because she plays with those dolls all the time. And then I picked up a few sets, like accessories or things for the dolls to play with. So this is like a little camping play set for the dolls. And I think she's going to love this. She's got three dolls now after that she gets this one and they can go on a little camping trip. She can use her imagination. It comes with so many things. It comes with a campfire that actually like lights up. I thought that was so cool. It also comes with a little camping chair, a tent for them and all of these other items, a little s'mores. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like a little s'more. So fun. When I was younger, I would have loved these things. I wanted an American Girl doll so bad when I was little, but my mom couldn't afford it and we just never bought one. I never got one. My friend, my best friend at the time had two. So when I would go to her house, we would always play with them and we, we loved it. So I think she's gonna have so much fun playing with her dolls with this set. And then I also picked up this cute little like washer and dryer set for the dolls. I figured she can just use her imagination. She can make them a, their own little house in her bedroom. She's got a bed for them and everything already. So I think this will be something really fun for her to be able to play with with her baby dolls. Maybe she'll learn how to do some laundry and she can help me with the wash then. We'll see. Okay, so this next item is one of the items I picked up from the Mercari app. This is this Disney princess. So she loves princesses. She loves anything about princess. But it's this Disney princess little, ooh, it's like a portable vanity. It turns into a suitcase, but she's got so much makeup, like I said before, that she needs something to carry it in. And like, look at this thing. It opens up. It's got this cute little mirror. It lights up so she can do her makeup in here. These little drawers fold out. So she's got all this, ooh, I'm gonna kill myself with it. 
She's got all this space to store all of her makeup in. I think she's gonna love this thing. And it even has, so after it folds up, it has little legs at the bottom that fold out so it can like stand up onto a table. She's gonna love this thing. I was so excited to find this on Mercari. These things are expensive if you buy them brand new. I was trying to save money and she didn't need a brand new one. She doesn't care about the little pretend makeup that goes in it or whatever that some of them come with if you buy them brand new. She just needs something to put her makeup in so she can carry it to room to room to room in the house and have it all over everywhere. So she's gonna love this thing. I was so excited about this. This is probably gonna be one of her favorite gifts that she gets. Okay, so these last two items I picked up from Facebook Marketplace. Somebody was selling these things in my area, in my neighborhood and they only wanted $15 for the two of them together as a set, $15. My daughter's been all obsessed with baby dolls lately. She's got all of these little babies that are twins and she plays with them constantly. She doesn't have a high chair or a cradle to rock them in, but this little high chair is so cute. Like it lifts up, it's got really cute pink flowers and it even comes with like a little pillow and a blanket and it rocks and I just thought this was such a great find. I was beyond excited when I found this. I thought the price was a mistake. $15 for both of these, like, don't forget to check out Facebook Marketplace. There is nothing wrong with giving your kids something secondhand. I mean, they don't know the difference. All they know is it's new to them and they're gonna have so much fun with it. There's nothing wrong with it, but that's all for my daughter. Let's move on to my son's gifts. I'm literally surrounded by presents right now. And now I'm gonna have to wrap all of these not gonna be fun all right guys now we're gonna move on to the gifts that i got for my two-year-old son brayden he also has quite a bit of things that i found so i'm just gonna hop right in and start showing them to you i love educational toys for my kids so when i found this vtech little phone perfect for two to five year olds it turns on and there's all of these different people he can call hello friend press the green call button to make a call goodbye I think he's just absolutely gonna have so much fun with this. He loves anything with buttons, anything that makes noise or plays things or songs or anything like that. So he's gonna love this. He always wants to play with my phone or his sister's iPad. So this is gonna be perfect for him. He's also really been into building blocks and building things lately and he loves animals. So when I found this leapfrog little builders safari animal set, I had to pick this up for him. This is from Target. I also got this on clearance when Target had their summer clearance. And I think he's just gonna absolutely love this. It plays music or sounds or phrases and it teaches them things. So it's educational and it will also be a lot of fun for him. It has animals, which is his favorite thing ever and also blocks. So he's gonna have so much fun with this. Next, I picked up this doctor play set for him. My daughter had a doctor play set when she was his age and she loved it. She had a Minnie Mouse one. So I figured he's at the perfect age to start playing doctor with his sister or with mommy and daddy. And he's gonna have so much fun with this. They're probably going to have a lot of fun with this together, which is, like I said before, also a win. So if you can find toys that both of your kids will enjoy and like to play with together, that is always fun. So they're going to have so much fun with this. Like I said before, he's into dinosaurs, crazy into dinosaurs. His second birthday was dinosaur themed. He loves them so much. So I picked him up this really cute dinosaur. It's an Adventure Force Roaring Rex dinosaur. You push his head down. And he makes chewing sounds and then oh. are you done all right i think it's done so he makes all these sounds and he breathes and growls and all that stuff and my son's gonna love this he doesn't have any dinosaurs like this that make noise so this is probably gonna be one of his favorite presents that he gets like I said before, I picked him up one of those bubble gun sets like I did for his sister. His is blue. Hopefully they work. Hopefully they have fun with them. So I did get that for him as well. I found this John Deere tractor set with all of these cute little animals it comes with. It comes with a horse, a cow, a pig, and a sheep. And he's going to love this so much. He loves trucks. He loves cars. And he loves animals. He's going to have so much fun with this play set. He doesn't have anything like this. So I think he's really going to enjoy this. In here, it has a spot for each animal to go. And it says the animal sounds when you put the animals in there. So cute. I also found this farm tractor playset. I thought he would have a lot of fun with this. It's like a cool little truck tractor. And it comes with a little guy. And he can just have fun playing with this. 
and it also makes noise, I'm not going to press the button because the, the things don't stop after you press the button, but you get the idea. He's going to have fun with that. He's going to love it. Next up is this kitchen play set. This is really for him and my daughter because they love to play with our little play kitchen in our basement together. But I found this set, it was $3 and like 60 cents or something at Walmart in the summertime. So I picked it up then. It comes with a little blender, it comes with a little mixer, and it also comes with a coffee maker. And they all make noise and do things. The blender, like the little thing spins around. So it's very realistic. They don't have anything like this for their play kitchen. So I know they're gonna have so much fun with this together. His favorite thing to do is play in his play kitchen when he goes in our basement and when he goes to his grandparents' house every Friday. The first thing he says to them is, me mom, grandpa, cook, which means he wants to go in their playroom and play with their little mini kitchen that they have in there for him and he wants to cook food. So he's gonna love this set. I think he's gonna have so much fun playing with it. I think he's gonna love to push all of the buttons and make all the noises and all of that too. So. He's gonna be so excited about this one and I'm so excited I found this one for so inexpensive. Next, I found this push bubble mower for him. I thought this was gonna be so much fun for him come summertime or springtime when it gets a little bit warmer outside and we can play around. He always likes to push things around out there. He sometimes pushes his sister's little strollers and stuff that he likes to just play with. So I thought this would be so much fun. He loves bubbles and when you push this one, bubbles come flying out of it. So. I thought he would think that was so cool and so much fun. And I think his sister will too. We used to have a little push mower, it broke. It didn't do bubbles though. So I think they're both gonna really enjoy this one. But this one's more for him because I think he's gonna like it a lot more than his sister will. But I just thought this was so cute. And I like to find things that they can play with outside because we love to be outside spring, summer, fall. Whenever it's warm out, we're outside in our backyard playing every day so he's gonna have so much fun with that once it gets a little bit warmer because it is too darn cold for me to go outside right now another great find that i found that i was so excited about is this leapfrog yum two three toaster another toy set that he can play with using his little kitchen it comes with little toasters it's got all these different things and leapfrog is a great brand for kids if you want to teach them things and you want them to develop and i think he's gonna love that the toast can go in and out of the toaster and goes up and down and he just loves sticking things in the like holes and I don't know. But I think he's really gonna like this. I think he's gonna have a lot of fun with this and it's also gonna be educational for him, which I really like. Teaches colors, numbers, all of that kind of thing. So what two year old boy is not obsessed with Blippi? My son is no exception to that. He loves Blippi. So I got him these two little Blippi action figures. They're like Blippi bendables they're called. So we got the regular Blippi and then we also have the Fireman Blippi and I think he's gonna love playing with these. And he also likes to have two of everything. So whenever he goes to bed, he needs to have something in each hand. So I figured two Blippies would be perfect for him. Also speaking of Blippi, I found these Blippi lunchbox surprise toys. So I picked up two of these for him. They have a little figure in it and three little accessories for the kids to play with. So I think he's really gonna like this, especially if the little figure is Blippi. You can't go wrong with that, so he's gonna be really excited about those. His next favorite thing to watch on TV is Coco Melon. So I found this little JJ riding a school bus. So I got this for him. This could also be a stocking stuffer. I was debating whether or not to put this in his stocking. I'm not sure yet, but I figured I'd share it with you anyway. I might do a what's in my kid's stocking video later on this season, but I figured I would just share this with you now because it was with all of his Christmas presents. So I thought it was so cute. Little JJ riding a school bus. And at Kohl's, I found this really cute Coco Melon musical book. And this little JJ comes off and it plays songs and all of that. And it's like this really soft plush book. He loves to sleep with books in his bed. And I thought this would be perfect for him in case he rolls over onto it. It's nice and soft and cushiony, so it won't hurt him. But it plays five Coco Melon songs, which he's gonna love this. Um, I did get this at Kohl's. It was full price, but I had Kohl's cash, so it was free. I didn't have to pay anything for it, which I thought was awesome. So he's gonna absolutely love this so much, and I cannot wait for him to see this on Christmas morning. I feel like I'm gonna constantly be hearing the Coco Melon songs, but what's new? Coco Melon is constantly playing on my TV anyway, so the songs are always in my head. His other favorite show is Peppa Pig. So Coco Melon, Blippi, and Peppa Pig are his absolute favorite things to watch on TV. So I found this cute little Peppa Pig Grandpa Pig Garden set. He loves the episode where Peppa goes to Grandpa's garden and picks uh, tomatoes or whatever it is. So I just thought that was really fun. He has a bunch of Peppa Pig little action figure play thingies. 
and I don't think he has a grandpa pig yet, so I think he'll really like this. One of his big presents is this Peppa Pig house. He's gonna go crazy with this. Like I said, he loves Peppa Pig, and this is a house. It comes with Peppa and Georgie Pig for him to play with, and then a couple little other accessories like a bed and all that, and little table and chairs. He's gonna have so much fun playing with this. His sister has her own Barbie houses and all of that, and he feels left out. She never wants him to touch her stuff, so he is now gonna have his own little Peppa Pig house to play with. He can keep it in his room if he wants and play with it whenever he wants to. He's gonna be so excited about this. This was on sale for $20 at Walmart this summer, and I could not be more excited about that because it retails normally for 60. So that is a great price. This next item is this Blue's Clues and You 123 School. So it's got Blue's Clues and Steve, or is his name Steve anymore? I don't even know. I'm not sure if his name's Steve anymore, but when I was younger, it was Blue and Steve. So who knows what his name is now, but it's this little cute little playset. He does not watch Blue's Clues, but it's like a little like building playset. So I thought he would enjoy this. It's got like a little school bus and you can like build everything and make the cars and all that. So it's kind of like Legos, but another educational one. It's from Leapfrog and Blue's Clues. So he loves dogs and he loves the color blue. So he probably love having a blue dog to play with. So I just thought this would be fun. I picked it up at Target when it was on sale and I just thought it'd be another fun thing for him to be able to play with and to learn with. It works with all other Leapfrog uh, leap set builders so it will work with his little safari one all right guys we're down to the last present let me get it because it is probably the biggest present of the day for him so hold on one second okay here it is i got this fisher price launch and loop raceway and look look how big it is you can't even see me i'm here guys hi yeah so this thing is awesome it is this like racetrack let me see if i can put it up here and hold it Okay, that's better. Now I can kind of show it to you and hold it easier. But it's like this little racetrack that has two little cars that comes with and you can make the racetrack and it loops and spins and twirls and all of that stuff. He loves race cars. He's been recently getting into like little race cars and like Hot Wheels and stuff. And this is gonna be his first little racetrack set and I think he's gonna love it so much. This was on sale at Walmart for $12 in the summertime and I was so excited when I found one for $12 because if you don't know, Walmart marks down their prices different at different stores at different times. So I found these full price at the same time at other Walmarts, but then I finally found one that was actually marked down to $12. And this is like his big present this year and I think he's absolutely gonna love it. I think his sister's gonna love playing with it with him and his dad and me. It's just gonna be a fun little thing that we can all play with together. We could race the cars and all of that. So that is his last gift of the day but I think he's gonna love it so, so much. All right, guys, that is all for what I got my kids for Christmas. I did get them quite a bit of items, but like I said, I did not pay a lot of money for it, which I really appreciate and I really like. So that is a win-win and they will get a lot of things and my bank account will be very happy with me about it. So I hope it gave you guys some ideas of gift things that you can get a five-year-old little girl or a two-year-old little boy. Like I said before, don't be afraid to shop secondhand because you will save a lot of money and you'll find some hidden gems that way. Check Facebook Marketplace, check the Mercari app, check eBay, check wherever you can get things secondhand, thrift stores or whatever, because you can find some really great things. Now I'm gonna have to wrap all this crap and put it away. So I'll catch you guys in my next video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you're new and if you wanna see more of my videos, Thank you guys so much for watching. I truly appreciate your friendship. Happy holidays. Bye.